Hello and welcome back to Magic the Gathering with me and Tom. Hello Tom. How you doing buddy? I'm good. We all did a draft earlier and we made decks out yeah. of basically six booster packs and a random rare that we were given. And um, what do you think your deck is, is, is good at? So I think it's kind of like a bit of like a slower deck. Slower um, deck. It gets like, there's a little bit of life gain. There's stuff with like minus one, minus one tokens. Oh, so, so you've got, got all these little things over there. Oh, and there's token creatures. I forgot to get my pile of token oh, no. creatures. Right, so, so it's seven. Seven cards draw. in your hand. And do we roll to start? Yeah. Ooh, what do I want a mulligan? That's a lot of crap in this hand. Um, do, you, do, you get, do you get to mulligan, is that a thing? Yeah, you can do a mulligan. And you draw less, one less. You, take one, you only get six cards, so you put your cards back and All you right, shuffle I'm doing them. That. Although, is it a lot of land? Yeah. Because I'd say, like, starting with like a lot of land, generally No isn't creatures, too... though. Oh, okay. Yeah, it's not good. Um, sometimes isn't the worst because these are like slower decks and so yeah. like having a lot of land to play I actually don't think is like too bad, too bad at all. That's better. Yeah? Yeah, much better. So, we'll roll. Do you want odds or evens? Odds. It's oh. even. Um, what is it? Is there a... So, whoever no goes first, mm, yeah. they don't draw a card on their first turn. So... Um, You're, would you want to go first or second? I think, I think I will go first. I'm happy okay. to do that. So I need to play a Plains, Ooh. a common Plains, which I'll tap, and then I'll play a Sacred Cat. It's Aww. a 1-1 one, one with lifelink. It also has Embalm, so Ooh. when it's dead, I can um, hey, one play light. it from my graveyard That's to create cool. a token copy of the creature. Um, and it's then a zombie. That's really cute as well. A zombie cat. Okay, well I've got a nastier one. Uh, and so that is the end end of my turn. All right, so I draw one. Yes. I play an island, full art island. Oh, oh man, beautiful okay. I didn't realize we were playing I that kind of game. I tap it, and I play a Slitherer Blade. Oh. Can't be blocked. Oh no. <laughs> okay, he's pretty cool. He is. It's a, a Naga Rogue. Naga Rogue. Naga, please. Here we go. Okay. Okay, I think, I, think I'm, I think I'm cool with this. So I get to, I uh, have to untap my yes. land. I take a thing, a little card, and I'm going to play. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna to play a. Um, I'm going to play a swamp. I am going to end my turn. Okay. Uh, right, so I, I didn't want to attack because your guy would just kill me. Because I would just me. kill your cat, and I wouldn't, I wouldn't die either. Yeah. yeah. So I'll untap, I'll draw, and um, I'll play a mountain. Ooh, Montagna. Montagna, and I will tap that mountain and play Bloodlust Inciter. Oh man, what's that? So I tap him. Target creature gains haste, haste until the end of so the turn. Whenever I bring out a new creature, I can oh, that's cool. make it attack straight away. He's big. He's a good one. And That's a real game changer right there. Yeah, yeah. He's definitely speeds the deck up. Um, and I haven't got anything else I can play, so I'll attack you with my Slitherer Blade, which oh, can't be blocked. I can't block it, so I'm on 19 life now. Indeed. That hurts. Just bitten by a snake. What the <sighs> hell? Who even does that? He's got a knife, actually. It stabbed me That's as well. called the Slitherer Blade as well, yeah. <laughs> He like he he milked his own venom onto his <gasps> knife, oh. so then he doesn't have to go through the ordeal of and actually biting someone. Because that can someone. really damage your teeth if you bite someone that's like a bit harder than you expect. Oh, that makes sense actually. Yeah. Can snakes? If a snake bites itself, does the poison affect it? I would have thought so. Yeah. Hmm. Let us know. <laughs> <laughs> um, I watched okay. this amazing video yesterday of a guy in VR playing some game. And he stabs himself with a knife and he just falls over dead. Really? What? <laughs> I guess there's a certain logic to it. That's pretty... That's kind of cool. Oh, man. Um, I'm going to play another Swamp. Swamp! Um, and then... Uh, I'm going to... I'm going to tap all three of my lands. I'm going to play an artifact. Oh, my! Luxor River Shrine. Oh, wow. I can pay one and tap it and I gain one life and I put a brick counter on it. Okay. Um, and when you get three, how many then bricks? I can just tap it, and I don't have to pay, and I gain two life. Activate Damn. this only if there are three bricks. That's pretty good. 
Uh, so um, I am then going to attack you for one. Oh my god! I'll take it. Okay, um, because my my cat has life link, you get one back. I gain one life. My goodness! So kind of kind of making money here. Yeah, that was good. That was like a two swing. Right? Yeah, the, big plays <laughs> right now. Big plays. All right, so you done? Yes, that's right. it. That's I'll all of my. Draw and I'll play an island. Nice. And I will play an ancient crab. Oh, oh my God! Look how tough he is. It's a one five. So that cat is not getting through him for a while. Oh no, And um, I'm going to stay, keep him back to block with, so then I'm going to attack you with both of these 1-1s. One oh, that's two damage, dropping me down to a, a mere 18 life. What do I want to play now? Uh, I'm going to put down the Cradle of the Accursed. It's a special land. So um, I can tap it to add one colourless mana to my mana oh. pool, um, or... I can pay three, tap it, sacrifice it, and create a 2-2 two, two black zombie creature. Oh, that's kind of cool. Um, so it's like a tomb yeah, with a guy like in a tomb, it. Yeah, it's like a tomb, the guy. And then he the guy wakes out up occasionally. And he'll come and like stamp, stamp around a little bit. What are you wake me up for? And then I'm going to tap three and play start. Mm. So this is like a jewel. Stop. Jewel. So it's got start and finish on the same okay, card. Okay, right. So start. Create two 1-1 one, one white warrior creature tokens with vigilance. Vigilance means I don't tap. That is correct. That's annoying. Oh, and he, he is untapped. So I've got I've got kind of like a bit of a... Um, I've got a bit of a posse here. I've got an army. An army of ones. Yeah, there's not a tough army. Not, not an army of one, an army of ones. Ones. <laughs> uh, so yeah, they... Um, that's the thing. All right. Cool. Um, okay, well, are you done? Uh, no, I'm going to do tap this. Oh, I see. And get and a, tap get a this life and back. gain a life, taking me up to 19 life. Uh, and brick. Look at this. A brick that's token. Like an actual brick token. Yeah, yeah. There's a legit brick on there. Okay. Cool. And then that's the end of end right. of my go. Sweet. Back in. And I play another mountain. That's nice. That's pretty idea, isn't it? Good. Good to be able to play a land every turn for the first few turns. Yeah. Now I really want to get this out, so I'm gonna I'm gonna start. I'm gonna play this. This is like this is a good card. This one, Curator of Mysteries. Ooh. He's a Sphinx. Oh. Uh, it's a four-four flying. Whenever I cycle or discard another card, I scry one, which means I get to look at the next card in my and choose to put it library. on the top or the bottom. Yeah. Oh, nice. Is that a thing? Okay. I think so. Cool. So that's my, my uh, one of my one of my best cards out there, and I'm going to attack you with the Slitherer Blade. So I take another damage, yeah. putting me on a 18. Anything and I'll up? also give this guy haste, and attack with him. Oh, big plays. So that's four. Ooh. Um, so I'm down to 14 now. Yeah. That hurts. That hurts, Duncan. That hurts. I'm going to start out by playing. Ooh, one of these. I'm going to tap two, three, mm. these, and uh, I'm going to use oh. Aftermath on this. Ooh. Cast this spell only from your graveyard. So this is the start and finish okay, card so it's again. the same card, yeah. Um, as an additional cost of, uh, cast, um, finish, sacrifice a creature. Okay. I'm going to kill... Warrior. Warrior. And destroy target creature. I'm going to destroy oh. your Sphinx. Oh, it's devastating. Uh, but now this card is not in my graveyard. That's I have exiled. to exile it. It's, it's gone. He's out of it. I mean, he's got to tear it up. It's what? <laughs> <laughs> it's gone. Just rip it up. Uh, and then I am going to tap this and play Supernatural Stamina. Whoa. This is often how I'm described. Yeah? Um, until the end of the turn, target creature gains plus two, plus zero, <gasps> and gains, when this creature dies, return to the battlefield tapped under its owner's control. What? 
good. I'm going to play on my sacred cat, and I'm going to attack you with him. So he's now a 3 0. Oh man! Uh, no, 3 1. You want to heal up, but he's going to die, but then he'll come back. Yes. So I'll block him with a crab. So I will. You gain three. Gain three life, taking me up to 17. He and dies. And then comes back tapped. But he's returned to play tapped. That's a pretty good one, that one. Uh, wow, what a good card. And then going to do this and this and go up to 18 <sighs> life. And. I just can't do damage another to you. Brick. I've got to get rid of that cat. <laughs> <laughs> this fucking cat. Meow. <laughs> <laughs> Are you done? I am done. Uh, let's play a Flame Blade Adept. Oh, what's he do? Menace. He's got Menace, and whenever I cycle or discard a card, he gets plus one, plus naught. Nice. Of the turn. Okay, let's play this one, which I can tap to see. Target the creature with power two or less cannot be blocked this turn. So Menace, menace means he can't be blocked by only one thing. Yeah, you have to right. block him by two. Okay, so I'll give him haste. Nice. And then I'll attack with these two. So that's two damage. Yeah. Taking me down to 16 life. And I am done. Okay. I'm going to start by playing a Swamp. Okay. And then I'm going to tap one, two, three, four, five. Uh-oh. And play Oketra's Attendant. That's um, exactly how you pronounce it as oh, well. Oketra's Attendant. He has Flying <gasps> and the Embalm ability, so I can return him to the, wow. the, the place. I'm going to tap one, tap this to gain a life. Take me up to 17 life, and it now has its third brick. No. It only takes three bricks to build a pyramid. <laughs> well, it's true. They're big bricks. You had one, look, there we go, three bricks, that's a pyramid. <laughs> <laughs> Mind blown. <laughs> um, question, if I use this ability, target creature with power two or less can't be blocked this turn. If I used it on someone and then buff them, could they then still be unblocked? I would I would say yes. I didn't really Maybe pay not. a massive amount of attention to my power levels and my creatures. They seem to all have one. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, a lot of mine <laughs> are Including ones this one, as well. which is my last card. Oh. Um, draw a card, then discard a card. Oh, that's cool. Activate this only if, if only you've cast now well, the problem is I've got, I've got nothing in my hand. Oh, so you need to wait some so turns. Whatever I draw, draw will have cards. to be discarded. That's tough. Yeah. Let's just attack you again for two. Two. Dropping me down to 15 life. I have to do at least two every turn now to keep you, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> keep you down at the same level. Okay, right. I'm going to untap those. I'm going to draw a card. I'm going to play a planes. And then um, I'm going to attack you with my flying bird man. That's three damage. Take the three. Okay. Um, I'm also going to pay three to uh, tap this. I'm going to sacrifice it and get a zombie. Put a two-two <gasps> zombie into play. Oh no! It's cool. I think, I think he'll help. Oh. Okay. Now we're getting somewhere. I'm going to tap two and play. The Doomed Dissenter. When the Doomed Dissenter dies, creates a 2 2 black zombie token. Oh, that it? Okay. <laughs> cool. And then I will. He's doomed. Then I'll attack with this guy. Okay, one seven. You done? Yes. Let's pay three. And I'll put illusionary wrappings on your. Oh no. Fine thing, which gives it a naught two. Enchanted creature has a base power and toughness of zero two. Yep. Oh shit, well that slows this, this <laughs> game down even more. <laughs> I was gonna die otherwise. And then I'll use this to uh, draw and then discard a card. Nice. And I will discard the mountain. Okay. Oh. And that means I've got this one now. So it's a two two, and I can pay one tapper and sacrifice her to a Retrieve a sorcery or instant card for nice, my that's cool. graveyard. So that's everything. Was that everything but one? Yeah, there we go. So right, uh, why can I do this? Let's give that haste for one thing. Yeah, this is untapped. This is tapped. Um, okay, that has this is this is now a two-two because I played a I discarded a card. Oh. 
Um, oh, that's nice. I will. So that has haste, um, and I will attack with this one, which can't be blocked. Yes. I will make um, this one unblockable. Okay. Well, no, I won't. I'll make this one unblockable. Yeah. Attack with her. Okay. And then I'll also attack with this one, which has to be blocked by two people. Two people? Okay. Um, I'll block that guy with my doomed deserter and my zombie. Okay. I'll kill the zombie. So, uh, he is dead. He also die. And then um, I take three three, three damage. <gasps> oh no! I've got him down by one. <laughs> You've broken the stalemate. <laughs> oh oh! The day is saved. Oh no! I no no! Not a second. <laughs> um, okay, I'm gonna tap four. And I'm gonna play the Soul Stinger. No. When Soul Stinger enters the battlefield, put two minus one minus one counters on target creature you control. Oh. When Soul Stinger dies, you may put a minus one minus one counter on target creature for each minus one minus one counter on Soul Stinger. Soul Stinger. What? So basically, I could put them on him, and when he dies, put them on someone else. Oh. But what I'm going to do is I'm going to put them on my bird and kill it. And then you're going to use. I embalm. kill the bird. <gasps> so I can't embalm him this turn because oh I don't have enough God. mana. But it does mean now I've got the Soul Stinger and I could bring my bird back. Good play. So I will uh, do that to gain two, taking me up to a 16. 16. Uh, and then I'm going to attack with my doomed dissenter. I'll block with the crab. The crab. The doomed dissenter dies. And turns into a zombie. And he, it turns out he has a zombie older brother. His zombie is... He's oh. going to come and beat you up. Oh really? Yeah. Is that how it works? Yeah, yeah. When he dies, create a two-two black zombie token creature. I assume that it was him that comes back as a zombie. No, no, he's his brother's a zombie. His brother. And comes, <laughs> yeah. oh you messing with my little brother. You killed my little brother. You fucking crab. <laughs> uh, and yeah, that's that's the end. That's all right. All. Let's untap my multitude of crap. <laughs> right. Please be something good. I I need something good. Yeah. I'll do. Oh god. Is it a god? It's not a god, but it's going to help me against flying. Okay. It is a Minotaur Sure Shot. Oh. It has reach. Oh, nice. And I can pay two to get one, one attack. Oh, that's great. Okay, so let's, let's, um, let's give it haste. Nice. Let's make it unblockable. Nice. I'll attack with the Slither Blade. And sure shot, and it can't be blocked, so Three. the damage goes through. But I will pay two to give it another one. Oh, so I'm on twelve life now. Yeah. Well, it's not up by tapping that, gaining two life. Take me to fourteen. And. On how much you've got from that card so far in this game? It's, good. it's been really good. It's been so like, it's be like efficient. A, it's nearly, I reckon he would have been nearly dead if it wasn't for that. Yeah, because you've been plinking away, yeah. doing like lots of little hits. Literally and saved you the game so far. Uh, I'm going to embalm my bird. Uh oh. And so it comes back as a three-three embalmed dude. Okay. Embalmed. Zombie now, is it? It's a zombie now. Ugh. Oh wait, wait, wait! I'm gonna, I'm gonna change this. Sorry, I'm just gonna do this differently. Okay. I've got a better way of doing it. Sure. Um, I'm going to pay two. I'm going to play the Binding Mummy. Whenever a zombie enters the battlefield under your control, you may tap target artifact or creature. Now I'm going to play oh. this guy, <gasps> the bird who's embalmed. Tap my goddamn crab, aren't you? <laughs> I'm gonna tap your goddamn crab. No. <laughs> And then I'm going to um, I'm going to attack with this guy, um, my my cat, my zombie, and that's it. So this is a five four. A, f a, a four, four five. five. I would die if I took all that damage, so I can't do that. Right, I'll let the cat go through. So, uh, well, yeah, we'll see. So he's going through. Yeah. I will 
I'll block the zombie with the 2-2. Two, two. And I'll block your guy, big guy, with my 1-3. Okay. So... So these both die. The zombie these two dies. both die. And that guy's fine. That guy's fine. And the cat deals one damage to you. And, and I gain, gain one life. One life. <laughs> oh. Okay. Useful. One. One. <gasps> two. Oh. Three. Hazarat. The oh, no. Fervent. Legendary creature god. Indestructible haste. Can't attack or block unless I have one or fewer cards in my hand. I have done. Wow. Um, I can pay two, three to discard a card and do two damage to you, but oh, man. I don't have any cards to discard. Oh, oh he's he, having a god on your side. I literally have god on my side. What a game changer. <laughs> right. Um, I think I will attack you with this as well. Okay, so those two are attacking. Yeah. So yeah, I think I'll block your big guy yeah. with my so little dies. little soldier, and um, I just take one unblock more damage. Yeah. It's looking looking bleak for me. Oh, oh man. Okay, I'm going to tap this to gain two life, <laughs> yeah. taking me up to sixteen. I cannot hurt you. Um, <laughs> oh god, that single card. And then I'm going to attack with these three. Right. All right, I'll block the flying with my reach and buff him by one. So we both die. Yeah. And I will block the four or five with my crab. So nothing happens. <laughs> nothing happens. What else we got left? This guy. Is he attacking? Uh, he's, he's not he's attacking. Not attacking. So the, just the... Just the just the cat. That's frustrating. <laughs> I'll let the cat go through. Okay, so this dude dies. Yeah. And he's now exiled. You're out of the game. Did um, well, though. So I go to 17 hit points. And that's it. That is everything. Okay. So this guy's obviously attacking. Oh, no. Um, and so is um, Hezerat. Yeah, he is. That's it. That's it. Okay. I think I'll. I think I'll take like take six damage. Damn. You really want to keep that one? I really want to kill it. Oh <laughs> no! Not my mummy. I'm gonna play planes. Okay. And then I'll tap this and go up to thirteen life. And. Um, I'm going to attack with these two. Okay. I am going to pay uh, three mana. Send him back to your hand. Send him back to my hand. And draw a card. Oh. Okay. <laughs> um, okay, cool. That sounds good. Um, and you attack with the cat as well? And the cat. Block the cat with the crab. Cool, the cat dies. But Finally! Um, but I gain one life. Yeah. <laughs> Got to 14. That damn thing. Yeah, I'm going to tap four. And I'll play the Soul Stinger. And I'll put a minus one, minus one counter on him. So he's only a three, four. And I'm going to put a minus one, minus one counter on this, the Binding Mummy, who's now a one, one. Okay. And it's. Uh, he's a, is he a zombie? Uh, no, he's a okay. scorpion demon. <laughs> scorpion demon? Did, did you not. Did you not, uh, could you not tell? No. That's racist. All right. <laughs> you done? <laughs> yeah, I'm done. Or, um, yeah, that's the, that's the attack. Six damage. Ooh. I'm going to take it. Owie. It's really only four damage. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I untap those and him and this guy. Ooh, yeah, that god, that god and the crab. That crab has just done all the work. He has. Uh, I'm gonna tell Lewis about that. And say, you know what the MVP was? It's a crab you told me to take out of my deck. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 You ending? It's the end of my turn. Okay. Well, I'm gonna use blazing volley. Oh no! Just one shit. damage to each of your creatures. Oh fuck! <laughs> My mommy is dead. And 
do 10 damage. I wonder if I got lethal. No, I don't. I don't have lethal. I will attack oh, yeah, you. I can, I can block one. Yeah. <laughs> one, two, three, four. I'll pay three. Discard this. And do two damage to you. Oh my god. Oh. Taking me down to eight. And then I'm... Oh, shit. I will go all in except for the crab. All in except for the crab. That's very smart. Because I'm going to play Jira's Resolve. Untap target creature. I guess I have to untap one of yours. <laughs> this guy. Um, prevent all damage that would be dealt this turn. Oh, there we go. Oh, I really wanted you to go in with the crab. <laughs> that would have been good. <laughs> I've never given him. So I took. And we got five healthy. Yes, I can't. I got at least something behind. Took no damage. Okay. Um, okay, I'm gonna play a planes. Oh man, you killing that mummy as well is like it's yeah. messed, messed up my my game. Uh, so I'm going to tap one to play the uh, embalm my cat. Oh no, <laughs> the cat's back. And the cat came back the very next day. Tap one to play the Dread Wanderer. Oh. Um, he comes into Blastfield tapped. Okay, what does he do? He's a 2-1, a but I can play him again from my battlefield. From your battlefield? Uh, from my graveyard. From your graveyard. Uh, and only if I've really got one or fewer cards in my hand. Right. And... You would have got destroyed without that card. Yeah, you so died badly. Like six, seven turns Man, ago. It's fucking. Uh, yeah, but once again, your crab. You would yeah. have died without crabby. True. true. <laughs> uh, it's your turn. Okay. One. I want to keep. No, I don't. Okay. Two, three, four, oh, five, shit. six. That's a lot of cards that you're. Desert Ceridon. Oh my god. It's, a six, six, four. it's just a six four. Oh. Um, oh. He's a big dude. He's a big dude. What's he even look? Oh, he's like a big triangle-headed bull. Oh, he's cool. Uh, you've got a three, four... Oh, I, think that, I think that's changed everything now. He's a big one. I'll attack with the god and the unblockable. And I'll give this guy haste and attack with him too. Ooh. Yeesh. I incited the bloodlust. Looks like the thing from Fantastic Beasts, doesn't it? Okay, I'll, I'll block that guy with my cat. Okay. <laughs> so <laughs> I gain, gain one life. So I gain one life. Uh, he's gone. He's exiled. And then I'll take six damage, but I only take five because of um, magic. Because uh, I gained a life. Oh, right, yeah. <laughs> Fair enough. So I'll tap that to go up to seven. <laughs> and then um, I will tap four to play another Soul Stinger. <laughs> Oh no, you have two of them. And we'll I'll put two minus one minus one tokens on this oh guy. Oh my god. Turning him into a one two <laughs> one two. Okay. He's no longer a problem. Um then I'm going to tap three and I'm going to gain six life. Ah, oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> <I know>. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> Um, sick. And then I, I see will... what you mean when you made a slow deck, yeah. just, just slow in general. Uh, then I'm going to attack with this guy. It's a two-one. Yeah. I'm blocking with the crab. Oh yeah, the crab. <laughs> uh, so he dies, um, yeah. and I'll tap three and play him. And he <laughs> tapped. <laughs> Oh yeah, shit, I forgot about the crab. <laughs> done. Fucking crabs. <laughs> okay, yeah, it's over to you. Alright. Oh, he's, I like this guy. Oh, you're in trouble now. Is it a mountain? No. Is it One, a mountain, Duncan? One, two, three, four. Is it a bird? It's a bird! A bird from Balm. Oh shit. And hate. Oh, fuck. And let's attack you with her, him, him. And him. Okay, right. I'll block that guy with this guy. I guess the Mega Rhino with this guy. So they both die. Okay. Yeah. Um, so I take three, four damage. Four. Yeah. Uh, taking me down to nine life. 
Um, I then get to put these tokens wherever I want them. Anywhere on the whole board? Uh, I can put a minus one, minus one on target creature for each minus one, minus oh. one. Um, wow. So can I split them? Because I want to put like... What does it say? They were all in one, were they? When, when it dies, you may put a minus one, minus one counter on target creature for each... Oh, so it does sound like it's yeah, just one. Yeah, one creature. Oh, that god is a problem. But the bird is probably a bigger problem, so I'll just I'll just kill the bird. No, <laughs> I got embalmed, man. Right oh, shit, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and you can just haste him again, can't you? Mm -hmm. um, okay, yeah, I think you might have me this turn. Or very soon. Uh, I'm going to go to 11. I'm going to tap... Your health is just tap two so hard to get down. And play a binding mummy. <laughs> oh, no. I don't like that. And I'll end end my go. I need to do 11. I think I probably can. Pay three and discard the mountain to do two damage to you. Oh. Okay. Takes me down to nine. And then I'll attack, attack these two. Those two? Yeah. Okay, I'll block with the jackal, the god, and then I'll take one, dropping me to eight. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So we 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 yelled at we we said Shin and Lewis took too long yeah. in their game. And we've taken like twice as long. So I'll tap three and play the jackal. <laughs> you can keep doing that. Oh man. And then I'll tap your crab with him. <gasps> I'll tap this and gain two life. Uh, Eleven was it? Oh uh, yeah, it's on bot nine, so I'm looking for an eleven. There we go. Cause I have no blockers and I'm dead. I'll pass. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. Tap all of that. Oh shit. Bring back the bird. Oh, okay. Um three damage. Four damage. Yeah, there's four that I definitely can't block. And this as well, which you can. Um yeah, I'll take it. No. So that's nine damage. <laughs> oh my god. I think, like, because otherwise I'll just be dead next so turn. You're just hoping that I get something. I don't think there's anything in here that can save me. But maybe. Just keep the Good dream plan. alive. Man, if I, if I just had two more mana, could I use that? Oh. <laughs> Oh shit, this doesn't actually save me at all. But oh. this would have been fucking amazing ages ago. Oh really? Um, what does it do? Well, not fucking amazing. It would have been It would have been better. So you want to tap this, I guess? Oh yeah, tap that to go <laughs> up to four. Yeah. Well, I think you can just kill me. Kill me with magic spells, can't you? What do you mean? Let's see. Uh, so yeah, I got four life. Um, yeah, I was kind of trying, trying for a Hail Mary this turn, but it is... I'll tap three, and I'll just play it. Uh, distribute two minus one, minus one tokens amongst one or two creatures. Oh. So I'll give... What would you have used it on? That guy minus one, minus one. Oh, you would have gotten rid of my bloodlust guy as well. And, like, that guy, if I could have just, like, just clearing yeah, the board yeah. a little bit would have been These two really have been cool. pretty handy, this game. This guy um, is amazing. Or, haste. like, just killing, like, that unblockable guy. Because you got him out turn one. Every, just every away. turn of the game, yeah. he's dealt a damage. So just for the sake of it, I'm going to kill him. <laughs> just him with both of the counters. No! Uh, he was my first. Yeah, I like just, just so as long as he's dead. <laughs> Damn. Then um, I'll attack with both of my guys. I'll block that one with the crab. Okay. And that one with the other thing. So you die. Yep. Uh, and I die, and I'll pay three, and I'll play him again, and okay. I will tap your crab. No! And that is it. Oh no, fuck, it wouldn't have done <laughs> gotten me enough damage, but I could have snuck two damage through to you this oh. turn. By putting a minus one, minus one on my guy, oh. minus one, minus one on your guy, replaying my dude, tapping your crab, attacking you for two, putting you on three life, Oh. But it wouldn't have been enough to kill you. I still had the other blocker though. But he only had, he was only a two. Yeah, you could, you could have snuck. So could have snuck. snuck two damage through. But this guy would have been tapped when he came back. Oh, yeah, yeah, so he couldn't attack. So don't be but this, I was, this well, one I still would have blocked it though, with the other blocker. I had a second blocker. 
I thought you only had um, the oh, crab and someone guy. else. Yeah, but if you attack the crab, it wouldn't be on attack with this one. But he, I'd, give, I'd kill him and that guy with the two minus oh, one see. minus you one kill counters. This guy, right, yeah, 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 I see. Yeah, you could have um, done two damage. But it's oh, not well. enough damage. Okay. Um, yeah. Well, I just, just kill you by discarding two mountains and tapping six mana. And um, exploding me. Oh. I am. So the victor. Killed by the god. A god destroyed <laughs> me. Oh, my mummies. <laughs> and my temple. Man, this, this no, temple. MVP. Just fucking, what an investment. It must have been at least like 30 or 40 health from that. It was so Jesus much. Christ. How many turns did like, we go on? How much life did that gain me? That was ridiculous. Oh, good game, Tom. Well played, sir. Thank that you. was, uh, man, it was good. I'm not sure like if there was anything. Oh, my super. Oh, you never got out. But it's just destroyed target permanent. I don't think it would have helped too much. Yeah. Cool. Oh, Thanks so for watching, everyone. And see you again for the next round. Bye. Bye.